Hey Chance, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Tag Along with Chai. We're taking you from Chiang Rai to a place called Sub Ruk, and that's where the three borders are meeting. Myanmar, Thailand and Laos. I'm also taking you to a very special location at the border of Laos. It's the most northern border crossing from Laos and Thailand. Hey, and you might think Chai, why are you Chiang Rai? What happened? Well, there was not enough people on the streets walking about. I just met one guy from Belgium and that was about it. It was not worth to make an episode out of this. So yeah, unfortunately, why are watching right? It's not gonna happen this year. Anyway, champs, it's gonna be a nice little road trip. Easy, two hour drive in total. So we're just gonna spend some time relaxing. We're gonna have a quick look in Myanmar and a quick look in Laos. Fantastic, and we're staying in Thailand. It's gonna be a nice road trip. I hope you join me for this. Um, I would say, let's go. I see fresh coffee, that's the perfect sign. That's exactly what I was hoping for. <laughs> so we're gonna have a quick coffee and then we carry on the ride. What do you think? Are you gonna have a coffee with me again? No, that would be amazing. A few of you actually had a coffee last time with me. Uh, we might be able to do that as well. I don't know if it's gonna be in the rice fields and like, I don't know, just saw a sign fresh coffee. Fresh coffee is fresh coffee, isn't it? <laughs> All right, champs, let's go. Uh oh, I don't know what that means, but the only thing I can read is 13. 13 is not, it's not a good number, is it? <laughs> the gate is partly open, but I think they're not serving coffee at the moment. So we're gonna carry on. That's unfortunate. I was looking for this coffee. Our yeah, fuel is running low and there is, a, um, there is a shop there, not a fuel station, but hopefully they sell a bottle of fuel. Normally you can buy a, uh, 50 baht, you can buy like 700 mils of, uh, of fuel. So hopefully that's the case. Holy cow. Some si baht. Oh, only some 30 baht. You have a uh, nam, nam plow. Thank you. Nice. Walk up. Oh, nice, nice little lady. Mm. I would say let's go. <laughs> James, we're here at the Golden Triangle. Actually, you can see Myanmar. There is a Paradise Hotel, I believe it's called, right in the center. Uh, Thailand, obviously, on this side. And then you got Lao, and we're gonna have a better look later on. Uh, but Lao is looking very rich, big buildings, casinos everywhere. It doesn't really make sense because Lao is way poorer than Thailand, so. I'm not too sure what's going on here. I just spoke to a lovely couple from France, I believe, and they've been on a boat trip. From here, they take you up the river and they go past a few casinos. You cannot go in, obviously, they're closed. Um, but yeah, the boat, boat tours are open. find a picture of the other side towards here because I think it's a pretty cool looking boat with the Buddha on top of it. This is also uh, where a lot of opium dealers are trading um, not so much here anymore but around the area like Chiang Rai yeah it can be really dangerous in the jungle. There are drug cartels here in Thailand uh, yeah smuggling smuggling opium I want to thank everyone, all the subscribers, new subscribers here. Welcome on board. There's quite a few of us now, a little group. And uh, I want to thank you and celebrate today by hitting the gong. Thank you, champs. <laughs> Just a little bit south of the river. I'm going to take you there. You're going to have some uh, better views on Lao. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna have some lunch there as well. Hopefully they open up as well soon. Anyway, Thailand open up. Woohoo! You can go, get your Thai pass. I was uh, watching Tiger on YouTube and there was this guy who was telling like, oh, the Thai pass, to get the Thai pass is a drama. Well, I, had, I have several friends now 
I've heard they're actually coming to Thailand with the Thai Pass, so it's doable. Uh, so yeah, if you're thinking of coming to Thailand, yeah, it's definitely like there's tourists here right now arriving today from another country doing one day quarantine only and then free, free to go wherever you want, champ. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Uh, have lunch? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Amazing, amazing. So can I sit there at the water? Yes, you can sit amazing. anywhere. It looks beautiful here. Yes. <laughs> Are you the owner? Are you the owner? Yes. Ah, oh, nice. Can I sit here? Is that okay? Okay, uh. I don't want to spend a lot of money on food or accommodation normally, so I can so I can show you, keep showing you this beautiful world. I would say. So yeah, that's. Uh, but sometimes you have to treat yourself. I think. What is this? Dry rice. Let me see. This looks really nice, actually. Uh, that's like Thai salad with Thai prawn and how's that called? Galangal. Okay, galangal. Galangal is galangal. Yeah, I think okay. it's galangal. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, um, it's like Thai herbs and spice. Lovely. And can I have? Uh, can I have that, please? Sure. That would be uh, nice. Can you do spicy? Medium? Yeah, I can just Thai spice. Okay, lovely. no problem. Okay, yeah. Cool. Anything Thank you. Else? That's it. My name is Chai. What's your name? Uh, Anjali. Anjali? Yeah. Well, is that your English name or do you actually have... That's Thai name actually. Anjali? But you can pronounce in English as well. Wow. Yeah. Oh, what's it in Thai? Anjali is mean like bowing, to be respected. Bowing? Oh, alright. Yeah. Oh, to be respected. <laughs> to be respected. Wow, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Alright, I'll get that one for you then. Anything for drinks? Uh, just the water with uh, water? If you have ice, ice, that would be nice. Yeah, yeah. Right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Hope Anjali. Hope you enjoy. Yeah, thanks. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, Anjali was just uh, helping us. She is the daughter of the <laughs> of the owner here, and uh, running the cafe. Flow, go with the flow, champs. <laughs> Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Are you around here? Sorry. Are you around here? No, I'm actually uh, Chiang, well, Bangkok and Chiang Mai. Yeah, that, <laughs> that looks delicious. Let me take you to Chiang Kong. Chiang Kong is the most northern border crossing going into Laos. At the moment, it is not possible to cross the border. But yeah, it's gonna be an interesting little village, I think. So I'm gonna take you there and I'm not too sure what to expect. And I didn't book anything yet. Gonna drive around, find an accommodation. Man, call it a day. It's going to be a bit of a short one, maybe. The first idea was going to Puchi Fa, but then I watched my friend Paddy Doyle, and he's going exactly in front of me, doing all these things that I want to do. But I'm obviously not going to do them as well. I want to be original. So I'm taking you not to uh, Puchi Fa. You can actually check his episode out if you want to go there. Paddy has, hasn't been to Puchi Dao, at least not with the camera. So uh, yeah, I'm going to take you there. It's a bit of a hike as well, an hour and... A half maybe uh, so yeah that's uh, gonna be exciting oh by the way I'm gonna have to do a special shout out uh, obviously to Paddy Paddy my friend he's got this amazing channel is gonna go through 77 provinces and uh, on his motorbike dreamy he's calling his motorbike and yeah he's doing a fantastic job and I want to do a shout out to one of our subscribers Armand he and his girlfriend, Sabba, was shooting me a comment saying like, hey, I am in Chiang Rai, you wanna meet? And they took me out for dinner. We had a good laugh and good food. So uh, thank you for that, champs. And uh, now let's crack on. The views are pretty good, like, <laughs> really. Um, also, I didn't expect the road has been amazing. I don't like to use the word amazing too much, but it is actually really, really good. Plus, most of the time, we are at the Mekong River, like driving next to it. And, you know, going up the hill, going down the hill, going up, going down, it's, yeah, it's stunning, stunning. <laughs> yeah, I just want to make a quick stop here to show you this. I serve coffee here. I didn't have a coffee yet, uh, although I had one in the morning, but yeah, let me take you for one more cup of coffee. <laughs> All right, jams. I think this is going to beat the rice fields. <laughs> quick 
coffee and then we have to go because it's getting dark soon champs <laughs> and we don't have any accommodation booked yet I was kind of hoping they had accommodation here it's a really really nice spot I didn't book any accommodation yet but what I'm gonna do I feel tired I'm probably gonna book something on booking.com checking in and then call it a day I just want to point out this is Lao on the opposite side you can actually hear it there's a monk talking, doing prayers. Uh, epic view. The Mekong River is just carrying on down south to uh, the Thai Sea. Thailand Sea? I think it's Thai Sea. Hopefully, I can keep entertaining you for much longer. So, I would like to say from Chiang Kong Village, uh, Border Cross Village, in the north of Thailand, bordering Lao at the Mekong River. <laughs> Bye for now. Stay champ. <laughs>